Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to show you guys how to download and install the Avira free antivirus for your Windows device. So this is going to be a pretty quick tutorial and we're going to jump right into it. And we're going to start by opening up a web browser. It doesn't matter which one, I'm going to start by opening up Google Chrome and then I'm going to navigate over to google.com. And then once you're on Google, you want to type in Avira free antivirus and then you want to enter to begin the search and one of the best matches that comes up if you scroll down a little bit I don't like clicking on ads to be honest especially when you're trying to get antivirus software there should be something that says Avira free antivirus for Windows and the domain should say avira.com you want to click on that one time to open it up and again I'd recommend you download it directly from the developers of the software it's usually your best bet and on the front page it says download Avira free antivirus for Windows Simplicity meets complete online security. Select this download button right here. Should begin the download, so just be patient. It's about four and a half megabytes, so not too big. And then once it's finished downloading, you just click on it one time to open up the executable. And I'm going to close out of the web browser at this point. It's no longer necessary. And you're going to get this setup wizard here. You want to accept and install, basically accepting the end user license agreement. And if you receive a user account control window, you want to select yes once you made sure it is a verified publisher, Avira Operations. So select yes. And you just want to let this run for a couple moments here. Okay, so it says Vera System Speedup. We're going to select Skip All because this looks like it's just trying to bundle other applications in here as well, and we don't necessarily need that. So we're going to just skip all for those. Okay, so it says your Vera free antivirus is installed. Click on the start of your free antivirus, and then you should be good to go. I'd recommend restarting your computer to make sure all the processes have been engaged. And that's pretty much it. It's a pretty standard procedure, to be honest. But I do hope I was able to help you guys out. And as always, thank you for watching, and I will catch you in the next tutorial. Goodbye.